it's all fine. Oh, no. Hi guys, so it's Abby and welcome back to my channel. Today we are in the kitchen and I'm joined by a very special guest, none other than Liam Payne. How are you? I'm very good. I'm nervously excited about this. What we're doing today, guys, is we are going to have a Christmas cook-off. Christmas um, cook-off. We're going to have this competition and see who makes the better roast potatoes, who makes the better yogurt. I don't even know what a yogurt log <laughs> is. Make sure to like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss an upload. Like and subscribe. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, that's wrong. And let's get right on into this video. I had to Google my recipe because I have no idea like where to even begin. Let's just see what happens. Here's some potatoes. Right. We have like three types of potatoes. So they're all mixed in together. That's so wrong. I don't know why anybody did that. These are definitely the wrong potatoes. They're different potatoes. Those are like the chip making potatoes. I'm telling you now, I think that guy's wrong. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Right, just get rid of him, he's gone. Let's peel away. dinner and stuff with my family my mum usually just like makes it all like I do nothing <laughs> so I have no idea what I'm doing I actually get laboured with doing the cooking quite a lot to be honest with you come on boil but I like it because you know how like there's always like some sort of like Christmas family tea going on at the same time like I feel like if you are like hidden behind the counter you can like watch it but you don't have to be part of it oh, something yeah. smells like it's burning already I we haven't even started cooking oven. yet oh yeah that is God. <laughs> <laughs> that's preheated I feel like we're on like QVC right now and we're selling them something. This peeler can peel anything. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone at home, be careful with knives. No, I don't want my knees. Do we have like bowls for... Yeah, where is, where is it? Right. <laughs> Hello! It says I have to chop them into pieces bigger than a ping pong ball. That's a weird choice of measurement, but okay. I actually nearly set my hair on fire doing this too. Okay, let's bring those bad boys to the boil. So ahead of me. <laughs> Which one do we want to go for? I'm going for the goose fat. I feel like I should go olive oil just to be different then, so we do different ones, right? Okay. So for Christmas, what do you guys usually do at your family? Do you have like a lot of people over? Uh, ever since I had my son, and um, yeah, now we have it all together pretty much. Are you spending this year with you at summer? Yeah. Always. Yeah. Always. Christmas Christmas is just about the kids. We're at a crucial point of potato making at the minute, guys. <laughs> I've got to wait until that slides back off that knife properly. They're not behaving. Oh, splash. Oh my god! Come here, you little bugger. See, that's how I know that one's gone. You lost it, you lost it. <laughs> so, we went through TikTok, kind of. Yes. Yeah. Hello. Because you're amazing at makeup and I do singing sometimes. I taught Liam how to do TikTok. You, ta you taught me everything you're, about TikTok. You're a professional now. I don't know how you do it 24 7. I really have to be in the mood to start fiddling around on TikTok. Yeah. Oh my god, it's all over the floor. <laughs> Whoops. Yoo hoo! Oh, it's sizzling away. Sizzling. This is where it all goes everywhere, though. If anyone knows an easier way to do this bit. Oh! I'm such a mess right now. <laughs> yeah, so we're using the new single, Naughty List, that you just came out with with Pixie the also really super random but it just kind of came yeah, about that way i mean about. you know the whole scenario with with the way it's been with covid and obviously us being able to like work in parks but not be able to work whatever um this song's been around for maybe about a year now and i'm not really? sure yeah it's i'm not sure where the idea came from but it, I mean, it just kind of came together it's one of those things we are back and now we're on our yule vlogs <laughs> so you're nervous about the yule vlog right? i've not a clue what i'm doing i picked up some eggs i don't know why I'm just getting my baking tray ready. Stiff beaks time, baby. Damn it. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Ah, there we go. Switcheroo. Well, I don't feel like these are stiff enough peaks now. I was deceived by like a couple of stiff peaks. The rest of it's like... What does it get? No, no, no! Speaking of your music and stuff, are you working on any new things right now? I'm looking in to next year, really. It's been a difficult year with everything going on. Trying to do things on Zoom and whatever else. And things have been like, okay, but I feel like, yeah, we've got more time coming into the next 
the next year. Yeah, I'm just working on my own music as well right now, which is really exciting. Oh, nice. Right. Making stuff myself. How are you feeling about all that? Um, I'm really excited. Yeah, I have like one song so far but that's like written and stuff. Ooh, um, you have to show me after. Well, I will do. I'll let you give Ooh, it a listen. You're getting the exclusive. I love it. <laughs> you guys have to wait. <laughs> Folding, 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 folding. We shot for it smells so nice. Your LP show over yeah. Halloween. How did you find it? Like having the show on Halloween. Uh, it was great. The Wi-Fi reception down there was awful for our TikTok <laughs> thing TikTok afterwards. Live yeah, was it did not, not happen. <laughs> not very good signal. Sing, 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 signal. But no, I mean it was a really fun show. It was more story driven and. You know, I haven't got to do anything like that since being on tour with the boys, really. Yeah. And just having those different moments where, like, it takes it away from just about music and we had the fan interaction and stuff. Do I, like, start making the icing before I put the thing in the oven? What would Mary Berry do? What would Mary Berry do? My cake looks anxious. He's like, oh! <laughs> Get a bit of that action, come on. Oh, no, I wasn't supposed to do that. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. Whatever, it's got some sugar on it. Our episode is a disaster. <laughs> It'll be fine. The famous last words before no one has any cake. There's no way that's turning into a log. It looks more like a muddy field. There's just no friggin' way. I'm waiting for my water to boil and then I'm melting my chocolate. Oh, that looks good, man. That's good, doesn't it? Mine's like a sugary hot mess. Is it pumped? It's all fine. Oh, no. Uh, we need a hot tea, like a hot towel. Yeah, we're good, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> Emergency <laughs> over! Oh, the log delicious. Oh, there's just no way this is growing. <gasps> it's turning into a Christmas sandwich. Whisk the cream to soft peaks this time. Oh, hang on, that, that happened quick. What the bloody hell's going on there? I think I made butter. What's like your favourite new like bit of TikTok that you found recently? Like one of my favourite people to watch is um, Spence Wall. He's so funny. He like does these videos called um, The Daily Scream. And like every day he'll just like run on TikTok. It's hilarious. Reroll and pop into the fridge. Oh, mine's, mine's such a sandwich. Different. Is there anyone we really don't like that we want to post this to for Christmas? <laughs> Oh yeah, you've done well there. See, mine turned into like a yeah. That's that looks good. Yours looks so <laughs> professional. I'm so scared. The moment for the truth. Yeah. I'm so impressed. I mean, yeah, the reels <laughs> killed it. Mine looks like an absolute earthquake compared to that. melting chocolate going wrong. Why has my melted chocolate gone with this? What's in it? Is it just chocolate? I don't know. <laughs> Put like too much cream in it so I think it's more of like liquid than solid chocolate. I don't think you're right. This is the least of my worry right now. <laughs> Cover all areas of, of bad. It's gonna need it. <laughs> Christmas. Oh. Christmas. <laughs> well I mean that was an adventure. I won't be doing it again. So we are now finished with all of our dishes that we, we made are. today. The first half we went really well, and then this now is, uh, I mean, yeah. I feel like it was kind of the opposite for me. I was like struggling with the roast potatoes, but they look pretty good to be honest. Let's see what the judges say. Who's going to be like the Simon Cowell of, of, the, of the judging? Who's going to be the Louis Walsh? <laughs> I think this is the best next to roasties. Okay. Mm. That's actually really good. That went really well. Smashed it. Mm. I'll give it a solid. Seven, seven and a half out of ten. I'm gonna say seven out of ten. Seven out of ten. I'm gonna go with a nine. Oh, Ooh, yeah. I gotta try the other one. These are really good. Nine out of ten. I'm gonna say eight out of ten. Eight you out can just add the edge because of the fluffy like inside of you. Eight, eight out of ten. It's an eight for me on the ends of Thank well. you. Abby just had an edge. Oh, thank you. Eight for Abby. Nice cake on Rira. Nine. Like an 8.5, I really liked it. A six. Nothing else for a little yeah. Oh, pretty good. Yeah, I think that's really good. Six out of ten. Five. I actually quite like the sugar crunch. Get a bit of that action. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I'd give it a six. A six. I'm still happy with that, considering what I was looking at. I thought yeah. I was looking at twos and threes. Thank you to all of our lovely judges. And now it's time to announce the winner. Dun, dun, dun. I won for the Yule Log and then Liam won for the potatoes. Because each of us won one of the dishes, I think we're going to leave it up to you guys at home to comment below who won overall. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video. This week's Artist of the Week goes to Alicia. Thank you so much for showing all of your love and support. If you would like to be next week's Artist of the Week, all you have to do is retweet this video link when that goes live on Twitter. Thank you so much, Liam. Thank you for having me. We've we learned new today. things today. <laughs> We've learned a lot of new things. It was so fun. It's been an emotional <laughs> journey. Once again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Don't set your kitchens on fire.